What's going on guys, it's Drana. Today we're gonna be going over this YouTuber named Lucy's. If you don't know who Lucy's is, he's a boxing YouTuber with 10,000 subscribers. He got known after pretending to be an e-girl and uploading boxing clips. People thought that he was just a really good e-girl. And then he started doing these things called boxing player ratings. And in the boxing player ratings, what he does is he rates players from one to 10 on how good they are. Like he's some sort of boxing guy just handing out people's worths just left and right. They kind of make fun of that. We're gonna be giving him a personality rating. So we're gonna total up all the weird stuff he does online at the end of the video. And then we're gonna give him a final rating out of 10. We're gonna rate his personality. I don't know. I just thought it'd be kind of funny. Give this video like a theme instead of just making it an exposed video. But at this video's core, this is just an exposed video, to be honest. We're gonna be exposing this kid for a bunch of gross stuff. The, the main thing is him trying to fly out and fuck a 16-year-old girl, getting and sending nudes with a 16-year-old girl. That's the main thing this guy's known for. Um, and just being a really gross dude and really weird. He's done a lot of weird stuff. He thinks he's God, thinks he's like some sort of testosterone scientist. It, that definitely makes no sense at all to you right now, but trust me, you're going to want to stick around to see what I'm talking about because it is really weird. Now, Lucy's does not like the word weird. If you take a look right here, I hate that word. I really hate the word weird. I don't know why he's trying to make it seem so deep, but Lucy's, I have a small hunch on why you don't like the word weird. Now, correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm gonna assume it's because you've been called weird, like, uh, uh, probably more times than you can remember, honestly. Now, what we're gonna do right here is we're gonna write the word, uh, weird in the top right corner of the screen, just to remind you that that's your label and that you're weird and that's all we see you as in this community. We don't really see you as this kind of profound boxing YouTuber or testosterone expert. We see you as weird, man. And I'll keep in mind, guys, being weird, it's not always a bad thing. You, you can be weird in a good way. Like, I think it's honestly, it's good to be a bit weird, man, right? Like, you don't want to be too normal. But this guy is weird in a bad way, which is something that is just really bad <laughs> pretty much i know what you guys might be thinking right now wow drana like you're kind of going a bit too hard on this kid like that's a bit messed up they have the word weird in the top right corner of the screen for the rest of the video well um yeah but you're not gonna really be thinking that after these next screenshots i show you guys yeah man not really much to say so i'm gonna move on to the screenshots now so for the first screenshot we have lucy's admitting to having a god complex now, if you don't know what a god complex is, it pretty much means that he thinks he's above everybody. I don't really know why, to be honest. I don't really see what's so special about him for him to think that, but he thinks he's god. He thinks he's above everybody. It's a really gross personality trait. People like this tend to be really selfish and narcissistic. To really put that into perspective, I have a clip of me from two days ago explaining why this is so bad, so I'm gonna cut to that right now. So I looked up traits of having a god complex, so I'm gonna just go over them right now this kid pretty much matches all these traits dude he's a sense of entitlement definitely thinks he's entitled to being the biggest boxing youtuber probably thinks he's entitled to girls as you guys will see later on in the screenshots probably thinks he's entitled to being a youtuber too just because he uploads frequently even though his content sucks and he has an inflated sense of self-importance definitely thinks the boxing scene just completely revolves around him even though he's just another leaf in the pile probably at the bottom of the pile his content sucks dude it's just like vape videos comboing people in slash disguise like trust me man you are not all that <laughs> exploitation of others yeah this kid tried to step on everybody to get to the the top as he probably thinks he's at right now um with his player rating videos man he's exploiting everyone in the comm to try and put himself above all of them like you guys see what that is right that's why i was saying that the player ratings are so weird because He's trying to say that he's above all these people, that he's just he's just handing out their worths, man. It's like uh, he's stepping over everybody to try and get to that. Pretty uh, pretty lame, if you ask me. Living in a world of fantasy? Uh, I don't know, bro. Oh, yeah, he thinks he's God. Definitely thinks he's God, bro. Probably thinks he's the only real person alive. I know a lot of people with God complexes uh, think like that. Demeaning, bullying, intimidating. I don't really know about that. I don't... I don't I mean, maybe. I'm not going to say maybe. I have no idea. Need for constant praise or admiration? Oh, 100%, which you guys will see in the screenshots where he brings up these weird things out of nowhere, like the testosterone, his, like, e-girls, his other, his thighs folder, bro. You'll, uh, you'll see later in the video. It's really weird. This guy is so obviously just loves praise and admiration, just wants to always talk about himself. It's just, uh... <laughs> It's a bit much, man. I can tell he definitely is like this off camera from uh, those screenshots that uh, 
you guys will see later on in the video. Examine how they treat other people. Oh yeah, man. In the other screenshots, you guys will see too. Sorry, a lot of this is foreshadow, man, but you guys will see in this one screenshot, the most important screenshot in the video, he treats this girl horribly, and it's so disgusting. And uh, yeah, I don't really know about the last one, but uh, yeah, man. God complex, terrible trait to have, disgusting. This is going to take a couple points off his score at the end of the video, for sure. Alright, so in this next set of screenshots, I'm going to call this the Testosterone series. To sum it up, he has this weird plan to give himself more testosterone where he manipulates e-girls online and just tries to get nudes from them to give him more testosterone? I, at least that's that's how what I'm understanding. That's pretty much how he explains it. So in here we have Lucius explaining why do I try to get e-girls? This might sound like I'm a bad person, but more bitches equal more testosterone. Yeah, I you guys are reading this right. He actually said this. <laughs> First off, yes, you are a bad person. What do you mean this might sound like I'm a bad person? You're trying to say that you don't see women as people. You see them as testosterone. If that's not a bad if you're not a bad person for thinking that i don't know what a bad person is anymore and when, he, when he's saying like up here he's referencing to the 16 year old e-girl who you're gonna see later in the uh, in the video and he's saying that pretty much he was only talking to her to get testosterone from it now I, i'm cringing right now even just saying that out loud but that's this kid's mindset it's pretty weird and gross and yeah, I don't really think I have to say anything else for the screenshots. I'll move on to the next one. This is a continuation of the same uh, conversation. He's just still going on about his testosterone plan. So we'll go over it and break it down. You see, e-girls, do you know how much testosterone you get when there are like 15 e-girls orbiting you? How do you think my jawline got so good? Bro, <laughs> I feel like that he thinks that he's coming off as this really profound, deep, smart guy who has just discovered the secret to just getting free testosterone. When in reality, he's coming off as like a loser, man. At least this, this is how I see it. I'm seeing it as somebody who's really insecure about how they look, so they're trying every method they can to try and boost their appearance. You really had to manipulate 15 e-girls to get your jawline better? Like, were you that ugly? Damn, bro. Like, <laughs> like what? And look at the responses he's given. He's giving him, bro. He's saying what, what, like how, what? How? That's, that's the. I think that's a proper response. I wouldn't even know how to respond to this, to be honest. I think I would say that, or I would just unadd. And then look at him, bro. Testosterone. Do you even know what that is? He thinks he's saying what because he's like, what? What are you talking about, Lucy? Your knowledge is too profound. Please dumb it down for me. Like, dude, he's saying what because what you just said is probably the weirdest thing he's heard all year. <laughs> it's not. He's. <laughs> Look at him, bro. He's trying to say, do you even know what testosterone is? Freaking moron. Like, bro. <laughs> Come on now, man. Come on now. So, ladies, if you're watching this and you're friends with Lucy's, just know that he doesn't see you as a person. He sees you as testosterone. You are just potential testosterone to this kid. Very strange. I know. It's just narcissist vibes <laughs> all around, man. <laughs> I have a thighs folder. I collect these photos like Pokemon cards. He's just like saying this out of nowhere. Like there is no way because I'm friends with the kid who was he was talking to and there was just no possible way he initiated any of these conversations. Like he just wants admiration and praise for this guy. It's like it, it's obvious, right? Like you guys can tell too. And it's praise for really weird, strange things. Like you're collecting you're we you seriously have a nudes vault, dude. Seriously? Like aren't you like 20? Like, come on, man. Really? Cringe, bro. No, dude. Look at this. Easy testosterone. <laughs> you, write, you write my name on your leg? That's easy testosterone. Bro. Oh, my. What the fuck, dude? I feel like this guy's like 10 mentally, and he's discovering for the first time that men like when women are submissive. Like, did he really? Why is he even saying this? Just What is the context for this, man? What? What in the weird? I, no, that's it for this clip. <laughs> so I'm gonna call this next series the child pornography series, not the pedophile series. Um, I know a lot of you are probably thinking that I got that word handy in the comments, but I don't think that this kid's a pedophile. What he's doing is still illegal. You can't uh, possess nudes from a 16 year old. 
can't send nudes of yourself to a 16 year old either it's also illegal however i don't think that he's doing this specifically because the girl's underage a pedophile is someone who's sexually attracted to children and i'm pretty sure that's not what's going on here so yeah here's the screenshots we got lucy's telling this girl that he likes thighs this bro i like thighs dude you're like a five-year-old <laughs> And then he's reminding the 16-year-old e-girl that she forgot to send him nudes. You forgot to send me thigh pics. Like, come on, man. Really? And he's putting, look at this little face he's got going on right here. Like, shut up, dude. I'm sorry, bro. P people who are this consumed by their hormones just disgust me. This is like weakness. Peak weakness. But yeah, wait, let's see what she says, bro. She says, I know. I'm sorry. I can't pull myself together. I hate myself. Now, what would uh, what would you guys say to this? Let me know in the comments what you guys would say to this. I think a normal person would say, "Oh, that's okay. I'm, uh, don't worry, don't even worry about it. Like, do you want to talk? What's going on? Are you okay?" But uh, how does uh, Lucy's the boxing YouTuber with with a god complex respond to this? With uh, let's see, he says, "Hmm, what about lewds? For example, uh, I don't even want to read that, man. Like, really, dude? Like, really?" He does not care. You are just, you're just meat to this kid. You are a meat bag to this kid. It's just, it's true. With, it's how this kid's thinking right now. And we saw it from the other screenshots with the testosterone screenshots. When this kid was talking about, he's only talking to you because you're giving him testosterone. It's just gross, man. Like ask if she's like, okay, bro. What do you mean? For example, send me your tits, dude. Like he's asking a 16 year old girl to send him pictures of her tits. When after she's saying she hates herself, you guys realize how much of a dirtbag this kid is, right? What else do I even have to explain for this? Nothing. I don't have to explain anything. Look at him, bro. Look at her, bro. She's still not into it. She's like, really? In her mind, she's probably like, did this kid really just say that to me? And he did. He actually did. This guy actually said this. And then this is later in the conversation. We have uh, Lucy's still like kind of pushing for nudes. The girl's still not in the mood. She's pressed. Like, she's saying she's ugly, bro. Like, talk to her, dude. Ask if she's okay. Look at him, bro. What, what, what does he respond with to uh, help her? You're not ugly. Do you squirt? <laughs> Sorry, I can't. It's like my third take, dude. I can't say this without laughing, bro. Like, do you squirt, bro? Do you squirt? <laughs> do you squirt? Like, when you put it... She definitely just, like, left him on, like delivered bro or unopened that's why i put this little dot here <laughs> like oh my god bro like tell me you're a virgin without telling me you're a virgin man do you squirt like seriously you did you just you didn't just ask her that no <laughs> okay i'm gonna have to leave a hashtag do you squirt comment in the comments man i'm gonna pin it because this is just too much for me to handle bro there's just no way this kid is real this kid has to be like a robot, dude. There is just no way somebody this corny can come into the community and just say shit like this. <laughs> no way, man. No way. All right. This next screenshot is pretty pathetic, honestly. We have Lucy's begging the 16-year-old e-girl for nudes. Look at this, man. Oh, what the fuck, dude? Like, oh my, bro. <sighs> Look at him, bro. He's like... He's like, he's going to bed in defeat. He's trying to make her feel bad. That's why he's saying that, by the way. Like, <laughs> a little manipulation tactic. I don't think it worked on her, though, sadly, man. Well, sadly for him. <laughs> but look at this, bro. Uh, don't even, don't even start with the small talk, bro. It's so, anyone can read through that, that you just want nudes from this girl, man. It's pretty obvious. But like, guys, come on. We can't be this down bad where we're begging girls like this for nudes even like guys life tip if you're ever this damn bad just beat trust just beat you can avoid all of this you can avoid looking like a horny loser like this kid does in this screenshot trust me best piece of advice i can give to you guys regarding a situation like this he's like man because i know you guys know how embarrassing this looks right like oh and look at the front dude i don't really know why he's bringing this up dude apparently he's trying to he's trying to tell her that this other girl who he's talking to is only a friend which is just i think it's just him trying to manipulate her into thinking that uh you're the only girl i'm talking to meanwhile you said you have like 15 e-girls orbiting you like 
dude really like what the manipulation bro like <laughs> these kids like like peak red flag like <sighs> let's move on you should visit me we could cuddle all day with fuck breaks it's a really cringe sentence i just read that made me uncomfortable to say out loud <laughs> but um yeah man could he make it any less obvious that he only wants to see this girl irl just to have sex with her to get testosterone from her that is the only reason he wants to uh, see you, to get testosterone from you and to have sex with you, to use you for your body. That is it. God, I'll pick you up at the airport so you don't get lost. Cute. Of course I would. Why? What do you mean, of course I She said cute, bro. What even is this response? Of course I'd pick you up. What did you expect? Why is he like being like mean, dude? I don't know. I wasn't thinking. Just find my house. Awesome, bro. <laughs> that's that's how it works, right? When, when you end up in a new country. Just, just find my house. What? Just find my house. You freaking idiot. Just, I don't need to pick you up. Who do you think you are? Testosterone meatbag. You find my house. You come to me. All right. That's pretty much what he's saying with this sentence right here. But uh, yeah, that's going to do it for the sets of the horny screenshots. Pretty weird. As you can tell, this guy's a pretty big narcissist and just wants to just manipulate e-girls to give him testosterone really weird really weird stuff going on all right next we're gonna be going over this kid's content and when i tell you this stuff is garbage i mean it is complete garbage i mean i think this vape promo his channel banner should speak for itself but yeah this kid's just the most basic generic boxing youtuber who sells out to every company ever uploads just vape videos just low effort content like, boxing player ratings of Verzai, dude. Like, what even is this? Yeah. Bro, sorry. <laughs> How do people watch this? This is just him cheating. You guys just like watching kids cheat? And he's just, yeah. it's just some kid slash Nick is Verzai. Bro, what? No. Hey. I bet he doesn't even know that Verzai cheated. <laughs> But yeah, man. And then uh, we got the player ratings too, man. Like from the God Complex, the exploitation of others. He thinks he's like, yeah, you look, man. He gives himself the second best rating on his channel. Puts everyone below him, which is him exploiting everyone to make himself look good. Even though, honestly, he puts kids who are better than him below him. Like um, Ash. I know Ash is regarded as the best boxing player. I don't know why he put him above put himself above Ash. Mario Kart's also definitely better than him. His styling's way better than his, dude. Plus, he's been leaderboards, too, so you're definitely not better than him. A lot of these players, I don't really know who they are, so I can't really say much, but I just think the whole boxing rating thing is just kind of stupid, egotistical, and weird. And, yeah, it's, it's, I don't know. I don't like it at all. <laughs>